welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Anna Maya, and I am back with another video. Okay, guys, so in today's video, I just wanted to do a little Shein haul. I've been trying to get this video put out for weeks now, but Shein shipping has like been really weird. They mailed it in like six different packages. And it was nothing like week by week. And the last piece finally came yesterday. So I'm just ready to put these clothes on for y'all. And let y'all kind of get a feel, a sense of my aesthetic that I'm going for. So without further ado, let's hop right into the video. Alright y'all, so now I'm about to get into the accessories that I bought. So the first thing I have is this cute little gold purse. It's kind of like a dupe for the, um, might be Balenciaga. I think it's a Balenciaga. Um, it's kind of like a dupe for that, for like the shape wise. It has a glare, so I'm trying to like figure out how I wanted to be placed on the screen but it's super cute i like it nice quality and it has a lot of space on the inside and it comes with a strap as well so the next purse i got is like that ego bag i don't know what the ego bag is a dupe of but this is the dupe of that so yeah it comes with a silver strap i really like it it kind of like has like a little vintage like baseball kind of look to it i really love this purse good quality and it has like a lot of room on the inside oh it comes with two straps this one and then this like chain strap this is gonna be super cute i can't wait to style this bag the next bag i got is just this cute little green twisty toe it's really textured and i like it i really been vibing with green lately this literally can go with the outfit that i'm wearing right now it's just a nice pop of color kind of like a statement piece because you don't really see purses with this type of texture so yeah super cute only thing that I'm kind of like worried about is how I'm going to wear this because in the picture she had like a strap with it but I don't see a strap in this bag and it's not that much room in here so like probably your phone and like keys and stuff can fit so I don't know if I'm going to wear this a lot but I still like it. The next bag I got is kind of like the gold one that I showed before but a little smaller. I've worn this bag before and it doesn't really have that much room in there. It comes with like a little wallet kind of like thing and then it comes with a strap but I don't think it would look cute with the strap. I feel like it would look kind of cheap with the strap. So, yeah. The next bag I got is this cute little gold and pink bag. Y'all, I had the worst time opening this bag. Like, it's so complex for no reason. Like, y'all, what the world? It doesn't have that much room in there. Like, only your phone and keys can fit. But I'm that type of, like, bad type of girl. I don't really like totes. Because I feel like when I have totes, I just like unnecessary st stuff. Oh, Lord. I feel like when I have totes, I just feel like a lot of unnecessary stuff in there and it kind of like gives off quarter vibes. So I kind of like to stick to the small bag. It's just my phone and the necessities that I need. The next bag I got is this cute little pearl bag and it has like pink on the inside. Y'all, when I see how this bag is like heavy, this bag is heavy. Like, oh my lord, y'all. I can't. You can take the pink casing out if you want because the bag is see-through. And it comes with like a little pearl strap. But I honestly think it just looks better like this but again it is really heavy so honestly i probably will end up wearing a little strap to it because uh -huh. next bag is this little sporty bag i really don't like shoulder bags because this is not my aesthetic i love a crossbody but yeah this is cute i guess um the color is really nice i love that it kind of has a little bit of room in here not really like again phone and the necessities but it's cute. I'm noticing like the quality of this bag is not good. It has like a little tear right here. I don't know, but yeah, it's still cute. I'll definitely be wearing this one. So the next bag is this little cute heart bag. It looks like real edgy. I really love this bag. When I seen it, I was like, this is so cute. And I've been wanting a heart shaped bag for a long time. I love hearts, like literally. My ring is heart shaped. This ring is heart shaped. Heart shaped necklace, heart shaped earring is like real cute. I had to get it um i love the little bangle right here like it's just like really edgy and gothic and i just really like it like this is definitely a statement piece in my opinion i don't really think i would put anything in this bag because it's like really hard to open so this is gonna be like probably just for pictures next thing i got is like a little prada bag so everybody be wearing um real cute comes with a coin purse little chain and yeah little pouch nothing too extra real simple just to throw on you know add a little pop to the fit i really like it all right so i got this one because i've been seeing this bag like all over tiktok and instagram and it's just so cute and i literally have the perfect outfit for these i think these look like really well with the fluffy to ugg slides so i'm definitely gonna cop me a pair of them but this bag is just super cute like i love it it's just really small like i wasn't expecting it to be this little so definitely 
gonna pair this with something real chill real cute i love it um there's no space in here so you're not even fitting a phone in here babe probably like a pack of gum and some keys so the last bag i got is like this little straw bag and i got it because i got these slides they go perfect with it for an outfit that i featured in this haul um super cute nothing spectacular um there's really not that much room on the inside and since it's like circular you're not gonna fit a phone here so like i said keys gum probably like a card i got like a little card holder because if y'all know me then you know that i don't have a wallet i've never owned a wallet before in my life i just throw it in my bag but like if i'm getting older and i'm like getting into totes because i have a tote bag baby it's like a tornado in there so i definitely need this because i've been looking for my car every day and it'd be like under so much junk so definitely recommend this it'll probably fit like four or five cards Nothing too major, real cute. So I actually got some phone cases. I got this little cute green one. I actually bought it literally the same case. It's just like a different color for the camera part. But I'll probably give it to my boyfriend because we have the same phone. Um, what else? These are super cute and good high quality. I really like this. It's just really different. And then I ended up getting this little cute pink one just because I need a pink phone case because I only have one phone. I only keep one phone case on my phone. I was like. Let me try to spruce it up a little bit because it's so ugly. I don't like it. So I got some little girly ones. Super cute. And then I also got this little cute cream color one just like the green one. It's kind of like a cover, like aesthetic. And I got it with the black case covering. And it's just so cute to me. Like, I like it. Like it's real different. And I feel like it fits that like aesthetic, the chill aesthetic. Now we're getting into the glasses. I actually got these and I've seen other people saying they like compare them to a Lorve Dieras brand. And I can kind of see it. The quality is really nice. Um I really like them. I'm gonna try them on. I feel like they're really cute. I don't know. Like definitely a statement piece and they're just cute. Good quality. What I got was these little cute sunglasses. I don't use the sunglasses or regular glasses, but I really love them. They're gonna look so nice for just like a pop of color to an outfit. Um, yeah, these are super cute. I like them. And I'm not even a glasses person, but when I say she has the best quality sunglasses or even prescription glasses, whatever you want to call it, they are top tier with the glasses. Like they never miss. These glasses I got are like the little it girl glasses. I guess you can say everybody got these glasses. Probably not this exact pair, but something similar. They're just black little oddly shaped glasses and they're like super cute these are really not my aesthetic i can't even do it because my lashes but these are not really my aesthetic but i got them because i know it'll go with some of the outfits that i have um i really like these super good quality and yeah these are really cute to me hey y'all so the last pair of sunglasses i got was these like red with white trimming they're super nice um they actually are black lens so i can't really see nothing when i put these on but these are super cute these are like a statement piece for like a, a, a plain outfit and i really like it I bought this pack of neutral colored um, cream socks, so like white, creams, brown, black. And then I bought these pink socks graphic. I think they say beloved blinds and lovers cannot see. Super cute. I probably would use it with my phone runners. And this one says something about happy, it drives people crazy. Something like that. I don't know. And I just bought this pack of white and black cool socks. I'm gonna take the jewelry out the bag just because I don't want to have to put it back in there because they're like really small things. So I got this like Duke Vivian Westwood necklace. Super cute. I can't wait to wear this. And then I got, everybody said this is like the Duke Van Cleef, but I don't know. I bought it before I even know what Van Cleef was, but it's super cute. So definitely recommend it. I bought two Apple Watch bands. Um, cheetah print and pink because I just wanted some new Apple Watch man. The other ones have been like irritating my skin. They're like nylon textured. So yeah. I also got a pack of these gold rings. But honestly they're giving like rose gold. So yeah they're just like a variety pack. I don't really even know what they say for real. I just bought them. Um, I bought this little cute 444 gold necklace. Real cute. I bought this set of bracelets for my Apple Watch just to pair it with. I really like it. I right. the pink ones to match the clear ones that I just showed y'all. Um, cute little anklet. Just go with like different colors on it. Simple. Um, I'm not sure what this is. I think it's just like a gold anklet. I don't really know. I can't tell. And then I bought this silver anklet just because I need anklets because I'm wearing a lot of stuff. I bought this little cute like um loungewear type thing. It's a top, which I honestly think might be too big for me. I'm not sure. And then it came kind of like hipster underwear. I'm gonna put the picture of the bottle on there because I cannot post this on YouTube, obviously. But it's real cute. I like it. The material is very nice. 
Um, I bought it again in this brown color. Super cute. I really like it. Well, yeah, super cute. Good material. Kind of like the film, but I mean film, but yeah, like I do kind of. I bought some little um, no-show panties because she lingerie is like really unmatched. Super good quality. Literally up there with Victoria's Secret. And then I think these are a candy as well. I'm not sure. Yeah, these are like thumb tight because I don't really like wearing like hips and stuff. I don't like candy lines. It's like a big thing for me. So super good quality. I think they're cotton if I'm not mistaken. So they're very breathable material. I bought these cute little sandals. I'm not going to try them on because I don't have my toes on it. But they're really cute. I feel like they're going to be really comfortable. They fit perfect. And I can't wait to wear these with my fit. And then I bought these viral TikTok sheen slides. Y'all, when I say these are so freaking comfortable and cute. Like, I just love how vibrant they are. And I love the little texture pattern it has going on. They fit true to size. And these are size 10 US in a size, I think, 41 or 42. I kind of like alternate between the two because sometimes the 41 is like kind of like skinny and my feet are kind of like wide type. If I walk around a lot, my feet go like really swollen easily. So I got a 42 and these are a 41. Last thing I got was this cute little hat, which I'm going to wear with that flannel outfit that you'll see in the next portion of this video. But it just matches so perfect and it's just so cute. And on the side it says mild jokers and on the back it says who, what, and why. And it just has a little W on the front. And I feel like it's just so cute. I will put it on, but I'm not trying to mess up my hair for the remainder of this video. So, yeah, super cute. Okay, y'all. So, the first outfit I got was this really cute Skims kind of like two-piece set. I got it in this dark chocolate color just because I'm really been obsessed with browns. And when I say the quality of this outfit is like super duper nice. Like, it literally feels exactly like Skims. It's hugging at the curves, giving you like an hourglass shape. Thick material, it just fits really nice, real good. Um, the only thing that I don't like about this outfit would have to be the little padded chest area because I am a flat chested girl and it kind of looks just like really weird in person, it looks kind of off putting. So, I'll probably end up taking these out, but it's still super cute. So, the next outfit that I got is identical to the first outfit, it's just missing the little cutout. But, like I said, they're really giving skims, hooking at the curves, and super nice quality, you know. I really went obsessed with browns if I didn't say that already. So, like, the majority of my clothes are, like, brown, neutral colors. I'm not really getting into that. Um, the only thing that I will say again is that I don't like the padded chest area. It just looks kind of weird. So, I'm going to probably take those out. But this outfit is, like, super cute. You can throw on, like, a flannel or something. And it'll, like, really tie this look together. So, I really like it. Real cute. Okay, y'all. So, this is the next um, piece of clothing. I got this, like, really cute oversized flannel and this is actually a plus size women's flannel and i thought it was going to be way bigger but it actually says like a regular oversized um i got this skim white two-piece set again i bet y'all like why does she keep getting all these two-piece sets but honestly i just like them because like if you're running late these type of outfits don't take any time to put the fits together they're literally already made you just gotta accessorize um this is an extra small but it's kind of like loose in the crotch area which i don't like but it's not noticeable it's really not noticeable or nothing. They still fit, but I don't really like this part. But you know, whatever. Nothing in the little back can't hide. Um, yeah, the top is not padded like the other two outfits I just showed, but it's kind of like real thin. Like you can literally see my nipples. So I probably have to like a little um tube top bra under this. I really don't know, but yeah, this is like real cute, real chill. Alright y'all, so this is the next fit. This one is an extra small. It's literally the exact same fit as the other one. The exact same piece. And this fits super big. Like look at the crotch. I'll probably have to return these or I'll probably just like wear these around the house or something. But these are like really kind of real loose. If y'all can't tell, they're super loose. So I don't know. But it's still the cute outfit to just lounge around the house in. I paired it with this like light wash grayish type of blue orangey little flannel i don't really feel like two pieces just look really cute with flannels or like a jacket or something so you know i don't know i was really debating on returning this because it looks like really odd like i can't wear this out i don't even want to wear this around the house because i just don't like how it looks like they look like boxers they look like underwear so i don't know all right y'all so the next fit is just this two-piece sweatshirt short combination set this actually fit better than i thought it would this is the size 
small i want to say so i'm happy that i didn't get an extra small because this would have definitely been too little like the sleeves are literally very short so i'm happy that i didn't get the extra small but yeah this fits like super nice super airy real cute if you're like running errands or if you're late to class and you can just throw on a real cute fit just pair it with some accessories and i think this would be like really a vibe so this is the next fit it's just some a jogging set honestly i bet y'all like why don't you keep getting all these like sweats with shirts and stuff but y'all listen i have too many like what is it called i have so many statement pieces in my closet and like with statement pieces you have to like put an outfit together but i'm gonna get some more like two-piece sets and chill stuff because it's like literally an outfit within it so if you don't have to do too much like i said just accessorize so i got this in a size extra small and they fit perfect definitely got nice length on them if y'all don't know i'm five seven so i'm kind of considered like tall and they go all the way down to my ankle only thing i would say is like the sleeves on this sweatshirt is kind of like small short but it's okay but this is like really nice quality real thick material it looks really nice all right so the next outfit i got was just these little gray sweatpants um they fit true to size as well but they keep like rising up at the ankle so i don't really know too much about that but I got these in an extra small and they fit very true to size. They're like a thinner material, but honestly, this is what you get when you pay $5 for sweatpants. So I'm not really tripping off that, but they look really cute. They don't have a drawstring. They're adjustable ways. So yeah, definitely recommend sizing down. You can really size down on these if you're skinny and if you're like on the larger side, definitely size up. All right, y'all. So the next pair of sweats I got are these like sage gray sweats. If y'all can't tell by now, I'm really like vibing with the neutral colors, pastel colors. These are so cute to me. Um, they're a little bit thicker material than the gray ones, but it's whatever. I probably pair these with like a little crop top or something. But this is like super cute. These are super cute. The color is like extremely vibrant, and I'm just really vibing with these sweatpants. All right, y'all. So the next piece i got was this three piece like chill lounge set when i say this is my favorite piece of clothing out of this whole entire haul i literally wear this outfit like every three weeks i'm not even kidding i wear it like literally every day it's super comfy it fits perfect i'm gonna lift it up so i can see the shorts i mean not the shorts the leggings like it literally fits so perfect for me to be skinny this is like the first leggings outfit i've ever bought and the pants like fit perfect you can honestly wear this without the little jacket but i feel like the jacket just really ties this outfit together it's really cute and comfy and i think it's like really that fit but honestly i think this is sold out because it was two different colors it was this cream and then it had a black one and i was gonna go back and get the black one but it was sold out and then i looked it up a couple days ago to see if they had restocked and i couldn't find this color with the black so yeah but it's still super cute 10 out of 10 recommend this is the next three piece set um this is like a teddy very kind of material it's really cute i got this just like lounge around my house and you know just a real chill pj set kind of um this is kind of like a little big i got it in a size extra small but it's fitting like a medium honestly um the pants i really don't like i didn't know they were bootcut i thought they were like the other ones like skinny jeans type of material but they're bootcut and they're kind of flooding so honestly i low-key might return these i really don't know because if i wash this set it's over so i don't know but the top is like really big at the top it's loose like in the straps so i'll definitely just wear this in the house till i'm drawing in i would not wear this out okay so the next thing the next chill set i got was this little cute roll i think it says princess on the back if i'm not mistaken comes with a hood super cute good material and yeah i don't really have so much to say about this but it's really cute and i like it this piece of item that i got was this cute little sweatshirt it's like little barbed wire on it and i just really like the details it's like real cute but a statement piece at the same time um i think this is in a size small because i do know that the extra small sleeves do were kind of little so i got a small but it's real cute real chill definitely gonna pair it with a bag that i bought that literally matches it perfect i just can't find it right now but when i do i do a lookbook with like some of the items from this um sheen haul because i bought some pieces that i think would pair well together because this i literally have a matching purse and i just realized it so definitely be on the lookout for a sheen lookbook in the upcoming few days the next hoodie that i got is this really cute cream colored hoodie it has like graphics on the back it's super cute I don't really remember what it says, but y'all can read, obviously. And I got this in a size small as well. And it fits, like, really good. I love the material. The only thing that I don't like about Shein hoodies and sweatshirts is that they start, like, 
catching on and stuff and like they end up getting like lint balls on them which is like really weird but it's okay still cute still really simple you know real cute like starting off with the graphic tees um it just says cosmic on there i don't know why about this i just like to buy like random crop tops because i am a crop top girl um this is an extra small the material is really thin you can literally see my nipples in this t-shirt um good quality though i feel like it's just thin right here like you can't see the actual nipple but you can like see the print you know so i probably have to like a bra or something under here because i don't like that but it's real cute breathable material just a nice quality crop this is like really cute i really like this it's just really it's kind of like a vintage vibe to it it's gonna look so nice with the fit that i have in mind this will definitely be featured in my lookbook video because this is just like a nice ass t-shirt it's really cute this is supposed to be like a fitted graphic tee but it's really oversized for some reason this is a size small because i thought it was going to be fitted but it's oversized so i definitely should have got an extra small but it's okay i probably just tuck it in on the side like this um i don't really have anything much to say about this graphic tee it's very nice quality which i'm surprised about because y'all know shane graphic tees and graphic hoodies be kind of like corny but this is like really cute i would probably you would probably like find this on like pretty little things or fashion over so i'm really impressed with shane they stepping it up because it didn't always just to be like this but yeah this is super cute i like it next item is this man's graphic tee um i really don't know how to feel about it because the man's items on shane don't have a stretch to it so this is like straightforward like you're not gonna really get that many styles out of this but i really like the graphics on the back super cute i actually bought these though a pair of jordans that i had bought but it didn't really match the colors weren't gonna be looking right so i don't really know what i'll end up wearing this with but it's a cute little chill outfit uh, so the next item is this cream color graphic tee this was actually supposed to be like a olive green but they said this is green but it's giving khaki it's not giving green so i don't really know what that's about the color did not look like this in the review so i'm pretty sure i'm going to end up returning this because i don't like it but this is the back i bought it to go with a pair of jordans but the color is obviously not going to match because the jordans are green and this is khaki so i gotta return this i don't like it it's not my cup of tea. The graphic on the back is just like super corny. It looks supposed to be like real cheap, so I don't recommend buying this one. All right, guys. So this is the this is two different items. Um, it's just this little cute like essentials type T-shirt. It just says Dreams on it and has like a little quote at the bottom. And I got these cargo pants, and I've been dying to get these cargo pants for months. I initially tried to get them in like May ish, but I was like I don't know because I don't really have my back to school stuff together. And y'all, tell me why I was going to go buy this in June and it was sold out. And it had just came back in stock two weeks ago. So these were the two items that was making me not be able to create content. But I'm happy they came. They fit super good. These are extra small. And they go all the way down to my ankles, which I like. They're boot cut. Kind of like a cargo feel. But at the same time, like a boot cut jean material. Like, it's like literally 50-50. They're not rough or anything. Super cozy, super comfy. And I just love these pants, like y'all. When I say I was like dying to get these pants, and I just really love them. All right, so the next two items I have is this like Skims like bodysuit. Y'all, when I say this um t this top is like squeezing my goods right now, this is real tight. I should have got a size small, but I think it's supposed to compress like this because it's like a bodysuit shaper type of thing. Um, it's tight so i don't know if you should size up or down i don't really wear stuff like this but yeah and then i paired with these little cute sheen jeans that i bought they have like a little graphic on there and then they're like frayed all over at the bottom and they're super cute i guess you can like call these boyfriend jeans but i really like them they're super cute super lightweight and i feel like this will pair really nice together all right guys so the next items i have is this super cute multicolored flannel i really love this flannel y'all I love the colors on brown skin. It just like, looks really good to me. It kind of gives off like football season, Friday night lights. It's getting fall, not really summer, but to each its own. I'll probably still wear it. Um, I think this is a size small. I'm not sure. I have to check. But it's super cute. I like it. Um, I have on this little bralette top. I don't really have any complaints. I don't know if it's see-through or not because I can't see it in the camera. But the material is like kind of thin, kind of thick. It's like 50 50. And then the shorts, I'm actually surprised that they fit, y'all. Because normally when I buy shorts off Sheen, they're, like, really big in the crotch. 
but I think the little details right here make it like less noticeable. It kind of looks like fitted a little bit. But these are a size triple zero, I think. And yeah, these are like really cute. This is like not for a straight shape body person. You have to like have curves to pull this off. And I don't really have curves, but it's still kind of cute. It gives me like cookout vibes. I don't know. I really just bought it because it looked good on the model. So definitely should have read the reviews on this one. But it's cute. I feel like I can still pull it off. It just needs the right accessories. And I actually think I bought this outfit in two more colors. So let's go ahead and get into those colors. All right, so this is the next fit. They actually aren't the same item, but they're like similar material. Um, This is really cute. I like it. This one fits way better than that one. I think it has something to do with like the crop effect. I really think it just looks better long. Um, It gives me cookout vibes, like I said. I'll probably wear it buttoned up and then like tuck down the side like that's really cute with the right accessories i also bought it in pink which i'm going to show out as well but this is like really cute i definitely recommend this <laughs> all right y'all so this is the same outfit in pink i honestly think it looks really cute with one side tucked in one side out it's just my opinion it's super cute super feminine again i think it gives me like cookout vibes it's like really cute i don't really know how to describe it but it's just it's really cute to me Pair this with the right accessories and this is a look, like honestly. So yeah, super cute. And I think I got this in the size, I think I got all three of these sets in the size extra small if I didn't mention that before. All right y'all, so this is a romper that I got. It's super cute. I got it in a size extra small, but honestly, I don't know if I should have sized up to a small or just like this, cause it was like hard getting it over my butt and my hips. So I don't know. Only thing I'm kind of like worried about is like this long V cut because it's like shows on the side because it's not super fitted, but it's still super cute. Definitely gonna put this in my lookbook. I like it. Giving very much brunch or maybe like, you know, if you want to just dress up on campus one day, it's just real cute and simple. It's not doing too much at all, and I really love this. So the next outfit that I got was this cute white and green romper. I got it in a size extra small, and I just really love how like clean it looks. Like this is like super cute. I really like this and I'm definitely gonna put it in my lookbook. Like this is just really nice and girly. I just like it. Like it's just real simple, but at the same time, it's like you look good. You don't have to try too hard with this, you know. So this is the next fit. It's like a polo type dress. It's real cute. I like it. Fit it real nice. I really don't have too much to say. It's just a regular dress. Um yeah. This is an extra small. And if they had an extra extra small, I would have definitely size down because i feel like it's kind of loose but i mean it is what it is super cute and it's giving like summer vibes i like it all right y'all so this is the next dress i am so in love with this dress i bought it in another color but when i say y'all this literally fits the body so nice i'm telling y'all i definitely recommend to size down with this because i got a size extra small and it fits perfect like literally shaped like a glove definitely enhances the body shape and it goes down to my ankle, so it's kind of like a maxi dress. And it's just like super nice material. Definitely giving skin. All right, this is literally the same dress as the other one. I just bought it in like a khaki nude color. I really just like it. Like it literally fits the body like a glove. And I'm going to go back and buy literally every single color this dress has to offer. This is super nice. Like, bro, look at the freaking shape. Like it literally gives me an hourglass shape. It's giving what you think. Hey, y'all, it's cute. Like, I'm obsessed with this. This is the next dress. It's super cute, a little lavender lilac color. I really like it. It's just like the other one, but it's like a more faded material kind of. Still fits like a glove. It doesn't go all the way down to my ankles, but it like stops like right underneath. I'm gonna try to on my tiptoes. Y'all still can see. But it like stops like right underneath my, um, what do you call it? What do you call it? I forgot. Right underneath this part of your knee. I forgot what it's called. I'm having a blind moment. But yeah, this is super cute. I would definitely pair this with like sneakers or something. It doesn't really give off sandals or heels in my opinion. But yeah, I really like this. Super cute, super fitted. All right, y'all. So this is the next dress. Um, This wasn't really what I was expecting it to be. Because in the picture, this little V cut was like real small. But I don't know. It's okay. I'll let it slide. Um, This is cute. Still fits like a glove. It's a rib kind of material. I really don't like rib stuff. It just looks like real cheap to me, my opinion, but I'll still wear it. Probably just gonna chill, go run errands in. And just like the other one, it stops like right underneath your kneecap. So yeah, for this, I don't know what I would pair it with, 
definitely not heels because it's more like a casual loungewear type dress but i still like it it's super cute so this is the white dress identical to the black one that i just had it's absolutely the same um i guess you can say it's kind of see-through so just like wear pasties or something with this and i'm pairing it like this oversized um men's blouse kind of button now but i wouldn't wear this in real life this is just like the last item that would pair with this because everything else is like crop stuff so yeah um the blouse fits really good love the color love the material does not feel cheap at all and yeah super cute this is a cute little dress i really like it i like the cutouts it's giving like i really want to wear this with these dunks that i just got sent to me for the next video that i'm uploading but i don't know it might look cute with heels too i got a bag to match everything like the fit is already here just gotta record the lookbook but i really like how it fits I wish it was like a little bit tighter because it's like a t-shirt material, not really like bodycon, so it's not stretchy. So this is the next dress. It's another graphic tee type dress. It says, I think, pour your heart out. And it has like a little quote right here. I don't know what they say. But this is a super good material. This is very stretchy and it's really thick. So you can't see anything. Cause you know most white coats I've seen, they're like so thin you can literally see your skin under the hood. So definitely recommend this. I literally know exactly what I'm wearing with this outfit. Like, the majority of these things, I literally bought the whole outfit off Sheen. And I just like this, y'all. It's real chill. Real cute. All right, y'all. So, this is the next fit. I honestly was not expecting the shirt to be so little. I seen it on another girl, Sheen Hall, on YouTube. And it was not looking like this. Child, we got the same body type, same size. And hers did not look like this. So, I don't really know what's going on. It didn't look like this in the reviews either. Like, literally, y'all. One wrong move, and I'm having a nip slip. But I really like how this outfit is paired together. It's really cute to me. This dress, I mean not dress, this skirt is so freaking nice. Like y'all, the material is like a velvet material and it just hugs the body so nice. And then the top, it's just a cute outfit to pair together. I might wear this together, I don't know. What I like to do when I buy clothes in bulk is to like buy certain things that are not my aesthetic. It's like push me out of my comfort zone. And I'm really happy that I bought this. Like, y'all, this is, like, so freaking cute to me. It's giving, like, Mexico tropical vacation. I love it. I feel like this is literally made for me, y'all. Like, girl, this is so cute and flattering on my body. I just love this freaking outfit. Y'all, this is so cute. Like, oh, my Lord. I think this might be my favorite yet. All right, y'all. So, that is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this haul because I put a lot of effort and time into making sure that it is going to be to the best quality and to the highest standard so i really hope y'all appreciate the content that i'm putting out i also want to say thank y'all for the support because i am noticing it i know that y'all follow me on instagram and like all my other socials and i'm just like really happy that y'all are finding my content aesthetically pleasing i'm just really happy that y'all are fucking with the channel so again thank y'all for the support and i'll see y'all in the next video bye